problem number 6 the equivalent resistance between a and b for the mesh shown in the figure is this is a figure given option 1 4.8 ohm option 2 7.2 ohm option 3 16 ohm option 4 30 ohm need 20 20 it's a simple problem just to find effective resistance as you see here this is 4 ohm, this is 8 ohm. These two are in series. They are in series. Okay? Because you see, if you imagine it goes like this and comes here, the two resistances are in series. Then this is in parallel with these two. Then this, 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 the whole thing will be in series. So you can redraw the diagram as this. Now, these two are in series. Okay? Therefore, effective resistance is 12 ohm. This 12 ohm in parallel with this. Therefore, for this portion, for this, okay? For this portion, 12 and 6 in parallel. So, effective resistance is 12 into 6 by 12 plus 6. 72 by 18 4 ohm right for this we can remember the formula is r1 r2 by r1 plus r2 two resistances are in parallel you can simply write this way okay now this 4 ohm this 4 ohm and this 8 ohm in series so final value or final will be this 4 ohm so 4 plus the one which we got here you know 4 ohm for this encircled one this is 4 ohm so another 4 plus this 8 ohm so 8 so answer is 16 ohm effective resistance 16 ohm which is given here that is the answer.